uh, behind you already folks are, are cleaning, they're prepping, they're getting things in place. Yeah, Curtis, a lot of volunteers out here, a lot of crews out here working to make sure Kauffman Stadium is going to be ready for the All-Star Game tonight. It's not until 7.30, so there's still a lot of time for the work to be done, but certainly a lot of work to be done. And, you know, work has continued all over our city for the last several months preparing for the All-Star Game. Really an opportunity for not just Kansas City to shine, but for the communities around the area as well. And they have been working hard trying to make sure they're able to impress all of the out-of-town guests. So let's head out to Raytown, you know, the closest community to Kauffman Stadium. They've been putting up banners to help welcome baseball fans to the area because it's likely a lot of those fans are going to be traveling through the Raytown area. City leaders there wanted to make sure that the main streets were clean, and the mayor says he really wants the city to look good. When they're driving from the hotel to the ballpark and they're driving through Raytown, they're going to remember if they see a dilapidated building. We have super splash coupons. Now, Raytown has also put together goodie bags for all of the fans that are arriving. Parkville also got into the sprucing up mix. They fixed English Landing Park after last year's flood. You'll remember that. A lot of the area suburbs also doing sign sweeps, trying to take down all those signs on power poles and roads. And Kansas City announced its plans for a pothole blitz to smooth out those roads before the All-Star Game. Of course, preparing for the thousands of fans that are here. You know, Curtis, I had read last week that it was something like 10,000 hotel rooms in our city. We're booked up. All of those people here to celebrate the all-star game that is happening here at Kauffman Stadium tonight. So, so exciting. What a time it is for Kansas City. It really is. And Kansas City is looking so great on the national.